Hi everyone. Uh, we the students of GRIT CSC has done our project on focus crawler using web using SEM. SEM. Uh, our project members are Pratap, Vimal, Pranti, and Vijay. Uh, we done our project on the guidance of Mrs. Sandhya. Uh, so here is the project. Actually, uh, since the uh, since it said when the world wide has become one of the largest and most regardably accessible repositories of our human knowledge, given the large volume of APIs, you are increasingly use web search engines to provide find specific information. These search engines index only static APIs. Uh, the advent of the web is the history of it is the following. Uh, uh, it has been first the early crawlers has come in out in 1994. Actually. Uh, why need web crawlers means uh, uh, how to find and collect data from this repository, uh, the largest public repository of data, the World Wide Web. Uh, 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 the solution comes from the web crawler. The definition of the web crawler is that a program that browses the World Wide Web in a methodological automatic manner designed to retrieve web pages and store them to a local repository. Actually, the usage of web crawler is that uh, uh, it is used by the search engines. Uh, to store the uh, visited web pages, to index them and uh, uh, use them for the later purpose. Uh, uh, it is also used uh, to validate the HTML code or hyperlinks on that particular web pages uh, that have been traversed. Uh, actually, the procedure, is, the procedure of the working of the web crawler is the following. Actually, uh, initially, uh, uh, a list of URLs uh, will be given and uh, it identifies all the hyperlinks in the page adds them the list, uh, list of URLs to visit. Uh, the diagram itself here explains the working of the crawler. Initially, the scheduler takes uh, some set of URLs uh, and the particular hyperlinks in that uh, uh, pairs of the URLs are being downloaded and the, these those uh, downloaded URLs are added to the queue uh, and, uh, and finally in here in storage, uh, the relevant URLs are stored. Uh, the procedure goes on continuously uh, and the required pairs will be stored in here in the storage panel. Uh, actually, uh, there are many types of crawlers uh, uh, based on the uh, type of web they search and the strategies they use. Uh, some of them are traditional crawler, periodic crawler, incremental crawler, focus crawler. And we have done our point on focus crawler. Focus crawler. Uh, uh, beyond the uh, uh, compared to the regular crawler, our focus crawler is that. Uh, it uh, visits the links from a page so that page is found to be relevant or not and for this purpose a classifier is used in here in the focus web crawler uh, and uh, many algorithms uh, are uh, uh, being used in the classifier uh, to give uh, uh, good results uh, actually the components of is that classifier which assigns relevance score to each page based on crawl topic crawler which visits page to based on crawler and relevance measure uh, here we are using SEM algorithm for classification purpose. Uh, uh, here we have the difference between the regular crawling and the focus crawling. Uh, in here in regular crawling, uh, we will be traversing every hyperlink that will be occurring in the uh, uh, page uh, that we have uh, traversed through the ceiling in given initially. And here in focus crawling, uh, that particular uh, page uh, if it is found to be relevant, then the further hyperlinks in that page are traversed. Uh, and if, the, if not, the hyperlinks in that page are not traversed. Uh, so that uh, only the regarding uh, data which, uh, which uh, should be uh, traversed is done here. Uh, uh, here we have three uh, components in our project. They, they are parallel crawler, classifier using SM algorithm and downloader. Uh, this diagram explains the uh, uh, these components of our project. Uh, in parallel crawler, uh, initially seeds are given and the crawl database is maintained uh, such that to know the mm, uh, to know the URLs that are traversed and here the, comes the classifier uh, which uh, which will be using the SEM algorithm. Uh, uh, it classifies the URLs uh, uh, to be relevant or not. Uh, unrelevant URLs have been discarded and the relevant one are uh, downloaded and uh, stored in the downloader. Uh, here parallel crawler. Parallel crawler is that which crawls through multiple threads. Uh, initially, a set of URLs is given as input. Crawl crawling is done in this space and the hyperlinks in them are downloaded. Uh, classifier using SM algorithm. Uh, here in classifier using SM algorithm, we are using SM. Where SM is mainly defined as support vector machine. It's a machine learning algorithm. Uh, 
basically a binary classifier. Uh, initially, its uh, duty is that uh, uh, it represents the, uh, the input given to it, uh, like the you know, product URLs are the input here. Uh, uh, it points it into the n dimensional space, and the hyperplane divides these uh, points into two classes uh, the one relevant one and the another irrelevant one. The relevant one are get discarded, and the relevant ones get stored. Uh, here we are mainly using the single class SVM uh, uh, such that uh, 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 the relevant ones uh, will be downloaded. Uh, uh, in here, uh, in initially, the training of some files, the SVM training of some files uh, will be happening in our project uh, such that we have used three SVM executables here, uh, mainly SVM predict and SVM train. Uh, initially, uh, we have taken some files uh, uh, regarding uh, topic like uh, Android tablets. Uh, uh, we have trained that files such that uh, the procedure is that uh, uh, initially the keywords from the URLs are taken uh, uh, and the document matrix is con document matrix is constructed there uh, and then it is converted uh, to view uh, db dot uh, mod uh, db file a uh, db dot file uh, and it is given as input to the SVM train file and uh, through the SVM train file we get an output uh, as db dot model file which is given as input to the SEM predict executable uh, 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 SEM predict executable and later uh, initial some seedlings are given to the crawler and then the procedure goes on and finally we get some uh, hyperlinks that are traversed and from those the keywords are taken uh, and uh, they are um, and they are uh, uh, feature extraction is done and they are uh, and the given uh, and the output from the feature extraction uh, is given as input to the SEM train file um, SEM train file and uh, the required uh, uh, file that uh, should be given as input to the SEM predict executable uh, is given there uh, and from there uh, the initial file and the uh, the then file uh, the input file are compared uh, and then the relevant URLs are uh, downloaded here uh, and finally the downloader uh, downloads the URLs that are uh, finally relevant and we now see the execution of our interface here uh, here initially choose the train files location uh, we will give the topic of the train files uh, and we will choose the path of the train files here and if you click the train uh, the files regarding the uh, the files the files which are the topic uh, the files of the topic which, are, which will be trained is trained by the SCM train executable and now then we enter the topic name here uh, output uh, uh, in which the output files have been will be stored and we will choose the destination path uh, uh, in here we are choosing the uh, path to be new folder here uh, uh, and then we will be entering the initial seeds here uh, the seeds will be Uh, initially, we will be entering the seeds here, and then the maximum number of threads is taken as 5, and the maximum buffer th th size is 1000. And we will click the crawl button here. And to stop the crawl, uh, uh, if you want to, then stop button is provided here. And if you click, if you click the crawl button, uh, then we will get the downloaded, uh, then we'll, the relevant uh, URLs will be get downloaded in here, and our output will be displayed in here like this. Uh, uh, these are the relevant URLs uh, that are finally downloaded. Uh, these are regarding the Android tablets and they contain the content regarding Android tablets. Uh, and here the limitations of product is that uh, the uh, internet uh, speed should be uh, considerably uh, high so that the execution of the product is done easily. Uh, and the threads, uh, the threads should be not should be uh, very the, the, the number of threads amount should not would, should be very high so that uh, the execution process will not get too slow okay thank you